All right, let's talk about Arginis Mendez against Juan Carlos Salgado uh, this past weekend. Uh, this fight was explosive right from the start. I knew Mendez meant business when I saw him throw that first left hook. He didn't land, but he was throwing those left hooks with a lot of power. Ironically, that ended up being the punch that that ended the fight in the fourth round. Pretty good, pretty good action fight. Um, uh, people are even talking about these guys fighting again. When to me, when fights end like that, I don't really personally see the need. Uh, maybe, may, maybe not. But I was uh, impressed with Mendez. I mean, he he seemed like he wanted to settle the score, and uh, he did say that he was going to put Salgado down for good, and uh, that's what he did. Uh, and I thought it was a good stoppage also by the referee. I mean, he was clearly hurt by that counter left that Mendez threw. And he and the ref waved it off immediately. I thought it was a pretty good stoppage. Uh, let me get some thoughts on Mendez and uh, where does he go from here. Uh, he's right now probably the number two guy at junior uh, lightweight. I think there's a couple of guys he can he can fight. Uh, Takashi Uchiyama, who's who's undefeated, 19-0-1, is at the top of the division. I like I like to see a guy like that tested. Uh, another guy who's in that top five, Roman Rocky Martinez, has a fight coming up in early April. What about uh, uh, late summer, early fall uh, for Salgado? Those are a couple of fights. And uh, a, a third one I'll throw out there is what about Eurokis Gamboa? Uh, if he can get past his issues, what about a fight there? Now, uh, I heard on one of the... Uh, on one of the websites, they say that Mendez has said that he's ready to jump up and wait and fight Broner. I say, why not? Uh, I'm not personally crazy about Broner jumping up two weight divisions to fight Malinaji. Uh, when to me, there's still a, a few good fights that Broner could fight at 135. Uh, why not see Mendez? I mean, he looked good. He looked like he a go at him and it looked like it would be a you know pretty much a slug fest i mean could he be tailor made for broner with his aggressive aggressiveness uh maybe so but those are a few fights out there for mendez uh you know honestly i'm looking forward to seeing him again pretty good fight this weekend uh uh you know it, it was pretty enjoyable pretty much that's my thoughts on mendez elgato thanks for listening talk to you later